You you're already live. Or fucking unmute, unmute. You know what I mean. I'm unmuted. Hello, chat. <laughs> Everyone is so mean to me all the time. Hello, chat, and happy World Orfish Day. Today is World Orfish Day. And there's the fucking ad break. Oh no! I'm being made fun of. I'm in ad jail, mom. Yeah, no, no, there's, there's, there's the ad, there's the ad. So we're going to stall through the ad and then we're going to take, pick up where we left off. Uh, oh, if I can't hear the echo of us over the fucking pop music. What well, pop music? It's an Oreo ad. Oh, it's so okay. Cool. It's pop music. Help. <laughs> I can't hear our echo. Wait, what echo? Well, if I have your stream unmuted, but I'm also in VC with you. Echo. Oh, okay. And I cannot hear the echo over the sound of Oreo pop music. Oreo pop music. <sighs> Oreo ice cream pop music. Oreo ice cream pop music? My mum. Uh, oh, shit. You've seen the Brennan Lee My Mulligan mom... video, right? You okay? I have, yeah. Yeah. My mum thinks I'm insane because I like Oreo. She thinks I taste like charcoal. I mean, there is a point to be made there. No, it is. But I like the taste. Sometimes things that are bad are good. Exactly. Oh, someone gifted you a sub. <gasps> Hang on. Thank the- oh, I can just send a default thank you. There we go. Charcoal and Oreos don't taste the same. They don't taste the same, but there is a similarity. Yeah, like I could definitely see what she- How many ads? Ad break will be done in one minute, it says. Oh my god. I have watched the same Oreo ad five times. Cause it just... Listen, listen, listen. This is- this is the ad setup. <laughs> That is least intrusive and gives me the most percentage of revenue. No, I know, but it would be less bad if it was different advertisements. But so far, it's been two Oreo ads, a toothpaste ad, I think and that two we are, more Oreo ads. I think that we are heading for the death of advertising. I'm Finally. praying that we're heading for the death of advertising. And that this is a sign of that because they're running out of ads, so they have to show the same ads multiple times. <gasps> I'm free of Oreo. I can hear the echo again. Yay! That's the lovingly rendered oarfish. Lovingly rendered oarfish! Okay, Yay. ad break done in 10 seconds. God. Fucking Twitch. Can't live with it, can't live without it. Can't relate. I only use Twitch to stream on, I don't watch Twitch. Oh, I don't watch it, I just mean like that's the platform that streaming stuff happens on. Um, yeah, we're dredging and shit. Yeah, we're dredging and shit. It is World Orfish Day. Um, shout out to the Orfish, the world's longest fish. Um, so, <laughs> I went looking for video games with Orfish in them. And Dredge has an Orfish in it. And I had Dredge, thanks to a friend of mine who gifted it to me. Thank you very much. Um... Orfish facts? Oh, I'd, I'd have to pull up the Orfish facts. I don't, I didn't memorize any. I don't know them off the top of my head, but I have the, like, I, I have a list to hand. Um, but let me, let me, let me finish my, my backstory. Wait, you also have a list to hand? Because I, I made a list for this. Based. No, listen, listen, listen. I had so many things to do today and my cat woke me up at 6.30. <laughs> I, I had to crash before this stream. Uh, I was like, I need to take a nap or I will die. Bouch. Anyway, so yes, the Orfish is in other games, but there's one Orfish in Dredge. And I asked around, because I do know some people who have played Dredge, and they say that it should take us somewhere between two and three hours to catch the Orfish. So, for Yay. World Orfish Day... I'm doing 
what is probably the first Orphish percent run of Dredge. And if I was more committed to this bit and on top of things, I would have had, like, speedrunning software set up. Um, <laughs> but I had, like, 17 things to do today, and I barely got them done. So I don't have it set up, and you're just going to have to pretend. Uh, but I do have an Orphish. Shout out to my friend Magnet Lattice, who made the, the model, and then Cap got it to render because it was bugged in some way. Uh... I, I think, could get the spin, though. I think that's all I have to say. Do you want to give us an Orphish fact? Uh... Pick a number. Twelve. Twelve? Well, you're, you're not gonna... <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> what? You're not going to believe this, I don't have a number 12. I have an 11 and a 13, I just don't have a number 12. Oh my god! Let's have Why 13 don't I have then? A number 12. Why don't I have a number 12? Um... I can read you number 11. D yeah, give me number 11. Um, other names include Ribbonfish, Streamerfish, and King of Herons. King of Herons? Her herrings. herrings. Oh, herrings. I was like, why is this, this fish, like, this is a cool fish, but why is it king of some birds? <laughs> I can't believe I don't have number 12. What the fuck is wrong? Semu says, additional fun fact, or fish are filter feeders, but don't have any teeth. Instead, they feed with extended internal gill structures called gill rakers. That's cool. Or fish are cool. Anyway, I'm gonna tab over to the game. Um, and I've got this little or fish graphic up on the side. Um, and if it gets too intrusive, let me know and I can move it. Uh, but, but, but that guy is staying with us for this stream. This is our mascot. Because it's Yay. World or Fish Day. Get vertical! Yeah, orfish, orfish do this thing where they just kind of stare. I was talking with Seebs, and Seebs was like, I don't like orfish. And I was like, are you not a fan of their autistic swag? And Seebs was like, what are you talking about? And I was like, you know, like the autism creature. And Seebs was like, what are you talking about? And I said, like, you know, TBH or yippee. And Seebs was like, what are you talking about? What? <laughs> Anyway. <laughs> oh, also, I finally have a controller sh set up on this machine. Um, and we are going to see how well it works. Firefly says, fun fact number 12, the Orphish is not King of Herons yet. I like this fact. I'll, I'll, I'll absorb this fact. Job listing, Angler wanted. I know basically nothing about this game. Me neither. I know that it had a crossover of some kind with Dave the Diver, which I think is very it funny did. because I'm pretty sure this is a horror game. I know that my friend loves this game. <laughs> Your friend should come to the stream. He's been yelling at me to play it for ages. The morning light fills your eyes and you try to sit upright. You're lying on the cold, wet dock where you collapsed the night before. A short man is shouting orders at a handful of workers disembarking from a boat nearby. The man notices you. Sikari says, Orfish fact. Orfish deserve to be able to fly. <laughs> and if Simu says, this fact sheet that I'm looking at has Orfish are not sea monsters, and then as a separate fact immediately afterwards, Orfish are not sea serpents. Incredible. Okay, also, if Cap or I are too loud or too quiet, or if the music is too loud, let me know, I can adjust things. Cap, do you want to do a mare impression? Uh, how much of an asshole do we want him? 
He looks like an arsehole. Okay. Welcome to Greater Marrow. I must say, quite the dramatic first impression. I see you've already introduced yourself to jagged rocks along the bay. Did you not see the lighthouse? It was shining right at you. Ah well, I'm glad to see our new fisherman upright and breathing. Your boat was hopelessly damaged, but I've had a few of the locals move your things into one of the old vessels. We'll catch up later to discuss more details. I'll let you get out there to catch some fish. See if you can fill your cargo while you get your bearings in the light. Hmm. Finally, I don't suppose I need to say this, but get back by sundown before the fog rolls in. Keep a close eye on the time, it can really keep up, creep up on you. Undark. Fucking Marrow. That's a shitty name for a town. I choose to believe that it is a misspelling of marrow, as in w with an E. I don't. I do choose blue to uh, shit. fish A. I don't. How does this fishing mini game work? Start fishing X. Press X at the right time to reel faster. Blue macro. Okay, cool. Oh, and the thing on the right is my inventory. Alright. I think it's your ship, more specifically. Because like, you have the engine and the fan at the back and then the fishing rod at the side. Yes, but also it appears to be the inventory. I'm not saying you're wrong. I'm just saying. I can't... Okay, I should have that. Oh! No, I didn't fail that. I'm so good at this. Okay. Okay, what time did they say sundown was again? Uh... They didn't. I think it's just, like, six. Okay. A floating buoy. It serves to mark safe passage past dangerous rocks and obscured hazards. Its dim light also provides a brief respite in the gloom of the night. What a buoy. That looks like something over there. I wanna see this. Yeah. It's giving me the, the tutorial because I didn't move the camera enough for it. <laughs> Like how you just died, and they're like, yeah, go fish. Did I die? I thought I just kind of washed up on rocks. shore. That's close enough. 20th of August, 1927. Oh, why? Ooh! Pursuits. Catch a fish for the day. Uh, the pill reaches a DLC, I think. Could be wrong. Map. Ooh, nice map. Alright, encyclopedia. Stella Basin, dude. Messages. Morning of the second day of the honeymoon, and our first day proper. Today we're sailing around the islands and inlets at the back of Greater Marrow. I love the rocks here. The layers and colors are so striking. Furthermore, the fishing is relatively poor in these shallows, so I know he will keep his hands on the wheel instead of the rods. He renamed the boat last night, Julie. He did a fancy renaming ceremony and everything. I think he took that more seriously than the wedding. Supposedly, it's very important to perform it correctly, lest you want ill fortune to follow the vessel. He wanted to throw away everything with the old name on it, but I kept the keychain. Ocean's Riches was a good name. I think he has prepared a surprise picnic lunch. I can see the basket half-hidden, stuffed under a blanket at the front of the cabin. I love it when he tries to be romantic. Okay. I think he's being romantic with the boat. <laughs> Time only advances when you're moving, fishing, or taking other specific actions. Cool. That's 
a buoy and not another message. Okay, I'm going to go fish some more. Um, so, speaking of... Yeah! Welcome down to the stream! It's Orfish Monday! I don't have the right equipment for this spot. Okay. Um, I don't remember... What's this? Do mackerel. Um, I don't remember what game it was, but there's a game where they added horses basically as a kind of pants that sit in your inventory while you're wearing them. Um, and the inventory was coded as basically a map. And they forgot to remove the horse behavior for the horse when it's in your inventory. Oh my god. So the horses wandered around the inventory. Uh, eating things, getting into trouble, wandering off the map and crashing the game. <laughs> and they had to roll it back. I don't remember what game this was. Oh, it's getting late. Ultima Online? I'm that so sounds awesome. right. Thank you, Absemu. Yeah, horse pants eating your inventory. It's like how trains are hats in Skyrim or however it is. Wait, that can't be right. They have they don't have trains in Skyrim, do they? What am I thinking of? I don't know. You step onto the dock at Greater Marrow. The mare is waiting nearby. Ah, I see you've returned in one piece. Very good. Before you head off to town, we should discuss the matter of your boat. Fallout New Vegas. Thank you, Sikari. As I mentioned earlier, your old boat was too badly damaged to be repaired. However, I'm more than happy to sell you a replacement vessel, yours to own. I understand you may not have the necessary funds on hand, so we'll consider it a loan. But I want to make this easy for you. Hmm. Until your debt is repaid, a tiny portion of your fish sales will go towards paying it off. A small amount of interest will go towards improving the town. Okay, so this is indentured servitude, and I'm pretty sure this guy destroyed my boat on purpose. Yup. I'm, I'm just being suspicious right now. I may not be correct, but that's how I'm reading it. He's a mayor. He's like the evil guy. That's true, that's true. So, to recap, you'll need to sell fish to the local market, paying off your debt, and in turn, keeping the population fed and satisfied. Understand? Where do I sell the fish? A local fishmonk will appraise and purchase what you catch. He's open all hours, 24-7. He doesn't sleep. I own him too. Oh, okay. I was going to ask if he sleeps, but you just offered that information unprompted. So I'm just going to accept that and maybe be thankful that the ocean is too dangerous at night for me to be out there, and therefore I have a built-in time to sleep. Off you go, then. Sow those fish while they're still fresh. Ignore the eye above my head. Fishmonger. Uh, storage, storage. Uh, how do I? I have no clue if these will come with me to the fishmonger. I don't know how this game works. You enter a squalid shack at the on the fringe of the marketplace. The familiar smell of fish fills the air. Flies buzz haphazardly around a downcast man behind the counter. Mm. Do you want to just do the voices? Yeah, sure. <laughs> You're the new fisherman, eh? Surprise! they found a new one so fast. What happened to the other one? Yeah. It takes a certain type of person to last out here. Not a life for everyone. Anyway, to business. 
I'll pay you for fish. Bigger and fresher means more money. Some species are just worth more too. Other towns and other islands might pay you different. But while you've still got debt outstanding here, I'd suggest you work on paying it up fast. Let's see what you got. Oh. I did the exact opposite Hobby. of what I was supposed no, to press do. Hobby. Press Hobby. Press Hobby. No, go back to the fishmonger. No, I need to put my stuff from storage back into the boat. No, you can, you can, you can, you can look at the storage from your thingy. Oh! Press RB. Sorry, I like I said, I woke up at 6.30 today because my cat decided I needed to be awake at 6.30. She went purr, 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 please pet cat. And I pet her and then she left the room and I said, okay, now I will close the door because I had to take the cats to the vet and they were not happy about it. All right. I assume to start with, I can just send, sell all of these. Yeah, I don't think it really matters. Debt adjusted. Debt adjusted. Uh, can we view the debt? Can we, can we view how much debt we have? <laughs> the mayor- I might tell you. The mayor is standing outside the fishmonger's store. Excellent work. I have no doubt you'll be able to revive for this town. Hmm. Look here. I found this down by the docks. I'm sure someone like you can make something out of it. Why don't you take it? Research power. Mm -hmm. I'll send that to storage for now. Oh! One last thing. Our local shipwright mentioned she might be able to make some modifications to your ship. She should pay you a, you should pay her a visit. Hang on, can we take a moment? Mischief thought that said fursuit updated. Yeah. Did it not? <laughs> I'm pretty sure it didn't. I'm pretty sure it was pursuit. <laughs> Listen, I'm a rich man, and I know lots of local independent artists. I think oh, love two wins. two go together. <laughs> love wins. <laughs> Research rest on dock. Chip loan repayments why? right there in the top middle. Oh. Oh, well, I should pay that off in no time. Actually, what is why? Yeah. Visit the ship, right? Okay. Yeah, I'll visit the ship, right? As you walk into oh, the yard, her. you see the shipwright making repairs to a damaged hull. She looks up at you briefly before turning back to her work. Ah. You must be the new fisherman. I can make improvements to your vessel in the yard. Mind you, I'm not in the business of doing favors around here. Payment is up front, and everything takes some time to install. Also, if you take on any damage from the rocks or any damage at all, I can patch it up. Mostly. She shrugs and gestures towards the hole she's currently attempting to repair. A number of wooden boards, all well above the waterline, are splintered and scratched. Simply just don't worry about it. This is normal. Uh, what's with the red line on the horizon? I have no idea. Take a look around. Just remember. The bigger the equipment, the longer it takes to install. So plan ahead. Okay. We can get other sh rods. Rusty outboard engine. What do we have for an engine currently? Peculiar engine. Cool, okay. Uh, so we could, I guess, add one of these. Troll nuts, nothing. Lights. We don't actually have a light, so we should make that our next goal, I guess. Probably. Uh, I'm going into this blind except for I know that there's an oarfish, and I know that it should take us about two to three hours to get the oarfish. 
Uh, and we know that it's a horror game. And we know that it's a horror game, and we know that there's fish, and I know that it had some sort of crossover with Dave the Diver, and that's about it. Uh, Cap, do you know anything? Um, I know my friend loves it. Okay. And he's played it like three times over. Okay. Do we want an improved? Hmm. Do we want a fishing rod or an engine? It's your choice. I can't decide. Uh, rod. Cool. Oh. That was the pull and not the rod. Whatever, it's the same thing. I mean, it's not the same thing, but like... Yeah. Oh, you can wake up in the middle of the night. Neat. Well... Daylight's a-wastin'. There's fish out there to catch. Whee! Fucking love the ocean, dude. Someday, I will know which button I'm pressing. Not today. Not today. Not any day soon either. Blue mackerel. I mean, it could be soon. I don't think so. Blue I'm mackerel. Why so mean to me all the time? Blue mackerel. Yet another blue mackerel. Well, yeah, I'm, I'm assuming that most of what we're going to catch right now is blue mackerel. Okay, is that something? Is that a buoy or is that a message? That's a boy. In the distance there? Uh, actually, I'm not sure. Actually, I think that might be a no message, sense yeah. says, yeah, I love it. I don't think it's very horror, but Moth can attest to being terrible at judging horror. Yeah, um... I've- I've watched some movies with no scent. I'm gonna leave it there. <laughs> um, so something about the- this game's setup keeps reminding me of, uh, another thing, and I'll try to tell that story between fishes. Um, but first I'm going to grab this bottle. Messages. 21st of August, 1927. Oh, hang on. The um, other one was also 20. The other one was 20, 20th, and this one's the 21st. Cool. I'm so smart. I've not gotten enough sleep. We had a slight accident yesterday around the shallows at the back of the Greater Marrow. A rock seemingly appeared out of nowhere and struck the front of the boat. It did not penetrate the hull, but it jostled us around and a few items fell overboard into the water. We did not see what they were, which is of some concern, but we believe all important articles are accounted for. He has been checking over some notes from the boat renaming ceremony. He is paranoid that he performed the steps incorrectly. I've never known him to be so superstitious. Yeah, because you kept the keychain. Your key ring. The, the... <sighs> no, since you should absolutely steal this setting. I would love to see you, your take on it. Um, semen superstitions are very inter interesting to me. Semen superstitions are so cool. I, listen, listen. I assume that all ocean fairy stuff is important or uh, interesting to you because, like, l look at your name. Shut up. I'm making fun of you. Shut up, shut up, shut up. I'm making fun of you. Go catch some blue mackerel, stinky. That's what I thought. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't have to say it like that.
What are the, what are the rotate. yellow things, by the way? Oh, oh, yes, I can rotate. Um, no, sit, tell me things. Dredge is my favorite rhythm game, says Mischief. I love how they vibrate when you move them around in the inventory. All right, let's head so back. wiggly. Lights help you see, but make you more visible too. Yes, I got that. Um, right. So I play Guild Wars two sometimes, um, and Guild Wars two had a thing where they had like their first expansion I guess was season one and season one was live and you had to be there for it and if you missed it you missed it um and I was several years late to the party and all of the content after that is like completely if you buy it you can play it uh they have now changed this season one is back and playable uh but I haven't played it yet, because I've been busy. Um, am I open to a minor gameplay optimization idea? Sure. Um, so season one is playable now, but it was not when I started playing and was first going through the story. And I was going through the story linearly, because I care a lot about that. And I decided to handle this the only way I could think of. Which was to assume that my character had a really bad head injury after the events of season one, has no clue who any of these people are, and is bluffing really hard. I've had a special order come in from a customer. If you can fulfill it, I'll pay you above the normal prices. They asked for one golf flounder and one grey eel. Just bring them when you have them. You'll need to have a rod that can handle the shallow water fish in order to catch those. The shipwright should be able to sort that for you. If you're ever hunting for sp encyclopedia, you could have the information you need. Oh, for specific species. <laughs> some food or not food uh money i'm so good at this you are save one nearby fishing spot so that when you head back in the evening you can pick up an extra fish or two yeah i i, I should probably do that uh ship right what you got for me i do want No, I don't think we need a very good... Okay, these can catch shallow. What can mine catch? Postal. If you press and hold X, you can sell all your fish at once without needing to select each of them. Thank you! I do want to know this. Okay. Yeah, I'll, I'll get this one, I guess. Uh, rotate. Rotate. No. Pull skimmer. Oh, two hours. No, that's not- that's not the- wait. Hang on, now I'm doubting myself. Shallow, coastal. So they're they're different. Rest. A hunched woman approaches you from the steps to the lighthouse. She stops some distance away and looks at you with concern and visible apprehension. Why are you here? Uh, because I was kidnapped here, send help. Tracks. I guess I've come to fish. 
there's nothing here for someone like you anymore. Do yourself a favor and move on. I get the feeling it didn't matter what I said. She turns and shuffles back along the path that leads to the light. Fucking mare? What does the mare want? Just the person I was hoping to see. Will you be sailing out to east towards Little Marrow? Would you give this package to the dock worker there, please? The mayor hands you a small, damp package bound in string. It's dripping slightly. The dock work will pay you upon delivery. Please be quick about it, I don't want it to spoil. Don't forget to check your compass and map if you get lost. Alright, alright. Um, I don't remember... Ah, it was in the cabin, cool. Okay. Wait. Wait, go down. Oh. Big question mark. I assume that's little. Marrow? Existential Terror says, it's a fresh heart, no question. Either that or maybe a fish. And No Sense says, ah, but is it beating? Oh, that's little Marrow. Across the... Oh, bay. across the bay there? Okay, that seems doable. We can do that now, I guess. Let's head out. Can you, like, investigate the package? You know, that's a good question. No. Room, room. Yeah, no, this this is a good game. I'm enjoying it so far. Um, I have I hadn't decided yet if I was gonna keep streaming it after today, but I, I think that sounds nice. I think I will. Yippee! I always get nervous in games where you have to be really close to dock. I'm like, I'm gonna fucking crash the ship. Um. What? A delivery? Let's see here. He tears a small hole in the paper and peeks inside. You can't say for sure, but it feels as though he's shielding it from your view. I'm just not gonna worry about it. Yeah, nice and fresh. This'll do nicely. And to pay you, I suppose? He hands you some 25 quid. money. I was given this old book a few weeks back, but it didn't make much sense to me. You'll surely get more use out of it. He pulls a crumpled book from his back pocket and hands it to you. A number of the pages are folded over. Keep it in your cabin. Perhaps you can read it while you're on the water. Stop by for a chat anytime. I know how lonely it can be. I have a feeling I'm about to get shamed. Oh, past time to read. Alright. Uh, let's go fishing. Yay! Ooh. That is not a blue mackerel. Stingray. That's new. That's now big. Speed boy. Okay. I don't have the right equipment. Is it just me or did the music change? It did, but I think that's because it's raining. Ah, okay. Let's see, there's a 
this spot over here I think is shallow. It's one of the Go flounder. I love you. Look at him, he's so dumb. You should be nicer to him. <laughs> that is me being nice. That's a compliment. Oh, you're weird shaped. I like you. Ooh. God. at this. I'm gonna hit this last one and then head back, I think. Oh. Squids. Interesting. Okay, that's different. Squib, 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 squib. Squib, squib, squib. The rhythm game? I'm Listen, I'm enjoying this game. I'm enjoying this game. Um, I can just sell all of these, right? I think so. Because the fishmonger wants the quest items anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Have you got any fish for that order? Oh, sorry. Just leave whatever you have here. I'll keep the order on ice until it's all ready to go. That was this one? Okay, and you don't have the great eel yet. Alright, come back when you have everything. Now, to regular business, eh? The seagulls didn't get... pests. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta give me a moment. No. Okay, hold X to sell all fish. Cool. I've got a bit of time. I am going to try and read this book. Oh! Okay, I misunderstood how that worked. Cool. Nice. I don't think I have anything else to do. How much money do I have? There's a little mayo thing in the bottom. Can you go to that? Oh, okay. What can I do for you? I'd like to pay off some of my debt. Of course. How much would you like to repay? You know, I don't remember how much my my deck, my deck, my deck. You have like nine pounds left. Nine dollars so yeah, even. All... Okay, cool. Fantastic. Now, what else can I do for you? Certainly. Is there somewhere in particular you wish to know more about? Well, the main port over there is a place called Ingfell. It's so right on the approach to the cliffs. So you can't miss it. It's a whaling town. But I haven't had much talk of it these days. I think quite a few people have left one way or another. Is there another area you'd like to discuss? Now what else can I do for you? What happened to the last fisherman? Hmm? The last fisherman? No, he was very unreliable. He'd go out at night, come back with no fish, and proceed to sleep all day. I will probably be doing that at some point. He was also a terrible captain. I mean really terrible. Constantly running around on the reef, even in broad daylight. The shipwright almost ran out of wood for repairs. I have a new theory. Mm? My theory is that we're the old fishermen, and we just got clobbered over the fucking head until we lost our memory. I'll incorporate that into my worldview. <laughs> no, he was no good. One evening he left and never came back. So long, shan't be missed by us. Now what else can I do for you? I should get back to fishing. By which I mean, I, I should go to bed. <laughs> the mayor is walking quickly towards you. He seems to be in a good mood, with a spring in his step. Uh oh. Fantastic news, thanks partially to your efforts. Greater Mara is growing. Our town is sure to be swarming with visitors any day now. Hmm. In fact, 
I've granted consent for the shipwright to expand her facilities. The old dry dock is optional again. Optional? Operational, even. <laughs> Oh. I've also allocated some money to improve the fishmonger services. Might have something to talk about you with a bit soon. Uh, mm -hmm. Obsema says possibly he also had his memory eaten by some nighttime gribbly or something. I don't know what's a gribbly. And Nosen points out that it is also optional, just also advisable. Keep up the good work. We're glad you've chosen to be here with us. See, I feel like I haven't chosen, but we can go with that. When I mean, you paid up your debt, you can leave now. That's true. This is the dry dock. We can make up the space. Extra Sorry. attachment points, even superior hulls. We'll need a decent stock of hard materials for these projects. Lumber, metal, scraps, that sort of thing. How do I get materials? There's plenty of decent materials around the coast from various shipwrecks to the like, like yours. I'm sure you'll find a way to get at them. Absimu says, Gridley is just synonym for monster in my dialect of internet lingo. Neat! I like it. I'm sealing that. Materials assigned towards upgrades here will be stored, so don't worry if you only have half of what you need. Does this mean that the creature from Annihilation is a Gridley bear? Okay, we don't have jack or shit yet, so. We have no jack and we have no shit. That looks like potentially a message. God damn it! Ah! You're dead. I'm not dead. <laughs> oh. Damage two out of three. <laughs> that was so bad. How did you do that? I'm not good at boats. Really? Someone is so mean to me all the time. You want people to be nicer to you and be better. Someone <laughs> is so mean to me all the time. Alright. Camera was uncooperative. No, I'm I'm truly just bad at games with this kind of mechanic. Okay, I want that letter in a bottle. Silhouette shows up in the what? water too. Neat. I didn't notice. Oh, I thought I saw one, but it is a buoy. Okay, cool. Good to know. Good to know. Um, so when I was a kid, I played Pop Tropica. I don't know if anyone else remembers that. Okay, I don't have the right equipment. Um, I played Pop Tropica, and I finished... Almost all of the islands that were out before I stopped playing, I'm pretty sure. Just keep fishing? Yeah, I'm just gonna keep fishing. Keep um, fishing. but I never finished Skullduggery Island. Because I just truly could not do that last battle. I could not do the naval combat. Did I get an eel yet? No. I'm, I'm looking for more, more shallow spots. I think this is a shallow spot up here. Um, I couldn't do the naval combat. Um, and then when Flash was dying... There's an oarfish run? Listen, I have invented the oarfish run. A hint about the eel? You're not, do You're not doing a very good job of it. My oarfish run? No. Oh. I've never played this game before. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. I think you can put it in the side while you reorder things. Okay, let's see. Oh, 
that's not gonna be any good either. No, if you put the flounder back to where it was, you had room. Flounder? Yeah, if you move the blue mackerel back down. And then move the flounder down into- yeah, now you have room in that gap. Ah, yes, thank you. Beautiful. Okay, I'm gonna head back. Do uh, do I want to hint about the eel? Yes, I want to hint about the eel. Okay, and I finished sustainable fishing. How how do I like Spooky Boat Simulator? I I love Spooky Boat Simulator. Um, I'm just not good at it. Flounders, eels by the lighthouse. Cool. Okay, love a sanity mechanic. I think that's a sanity mechanic. It is, yeah. Not really, not again. No, you're, you're fine. You don't have to repeat, read repeated dialogue. Too busy eating popcorn. Okay, yeah, no, uh, none of these are the eels, I think. Goodbye, fish. Let me get my ship repaired. Repair all, $60. I can eat that cost. I will try not to get banged up again. get a light. Sanity mechanic is really good. Let me see that. Book. 10% chance to not reduce fishing stocks when catching a fish with a rod. Hey. Okay, uh, so when Flash was dying and Flashpoint was like, brought to my attention and so on, I was like, oh. There's a- someone- someone made a- it's not included with Flashpoint, um, but someone made a- an add-on for Flashpoint that adds Old Pop Tropica. And I was like, oh, I should replay that. And I got to Skullduggery Island. And I got to the last battle. And I couldn't do it! <laughs> and I tried wow. a bunch of times, and I couldn't do it. And I finally went to Seeds, and I was like, I can't do this fucking battle. Can you do it for me? And Seeds went, yeah, sure, and did it in one try. Uh -huh. Very humbling moment. Okay. By the way. It's okay, we know you're bad at video games. Why are so mean to me all the time? You're right. I'm, I'm right, though. Uh... Where? Oh, these? Yay! Trophy cot. Okay. Thank you, Nosen. Catch another one and use the known trophy one for the quest and sell the trophy one? Yeah. No, I, I, I figured. Did I? No, well, I have to. I've got a trophy one and a non-trophy one. We're good.
I guess I'll go over here and see what they're up to. What is this telling me? Encyclopedia. Oh, also, heads up that the ad break's gonna come in a few minutes. Love me an ad break. <laughs> what is this, an encyclopedia for eels? <laughs> Thanks, Obsemu. You enter a brightly lit shop. It's packed with antiques, the shelves full of jewelry and other baubles. An old man peers at you over silver spectacles. Hello? Is that- Ah, oh, no, I don't believe we've met. Forgive me, my eyes aren't what they used to be. I specialize in antiques and jewelry. I'll purchase any special trinkets you happen to have. You got anything nice with you today, perhaps? Ignore nope. the script I'm writing in. Don't worry about it. Upsemu says my suspicion is increasing. Mine too. I feel like I was saying something. I don't know. Anyway, someone was complaining about me not doing the Orphish percent run fast enough. Listen, listen. I'm the first person to try this to my to my knowledge, uh, and it's about the journey, not the destination. It's about enjoying World Orphish Day. I don't know how to play- I mean, now I know how to play this game, but I, like, I did not come into this game with, like, prior knowledge and a plan. <laughs> uh, storage. Let me store this guy. And now I go to the fishmonger. The fishmonger wraps up the fish and hands you some money. Good, good. Oh, sorry, that's you. Good, good. They should be pleased with this. Got another order here. This one's a little more curious. They want a couple of squid and a whole black grouper. Don't see many people fishing squid these days. They only feed at night, and well, you know what night's like around here. Good luck. The music is good. Uh, pursuits. Two squid and one black grouper. We could absolutely upgrade our rod here. Probably. I think that might be a good idea. Uh, do I have to uninstall this before I sell it or can I just sell it? Oh, I have no idea. Chat. Well, I'm asking because Nocent is in the chat, and I, 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 I assume Nocent will know. Ooh, I actually feel awake now. Should be able to sell it from installed? Cool. Yay! Woken by the anticipation of Warfish? Skies were lit up with... Weird crimson glow? 
That's the line I'm talking about. It's right there. I did not process it. I was waking up. <laughs> yeah, that was the line I was talking about. Like, that weird freaking red beacon. It's just been there. So it is. It's the Aurora Borealis, localized entirely to this town. Okay, sure. Or whatever the Simpsons quote is. Haven't you ever seen a lighthouse? The lighthouse is in the other direction, Sikari. Mm, gotta fish at night. Well, let's go fish. There... Am I gonna have trouble if I don't rest? Also, where are squid? How many squid did we need? Was it two and one black Just... grouper or the other way around? Yeah, it was, yeah, it was two. Two and one. So two squid. Two squids. Um, are the black groupers also at night? Cool. Let me see if I can find another fishing spot. But yeah, this isn't. This isn't a speed run, really. This is. Uh, we're here for World Orfish Day, and we're gonna play until we get the orfish. I'm not worried about it. No, sin. I would love hints on where things are. I don't want to look things up because looking things up takes time. But if you tell me where things are, I will go get them. Groupers are to the right of the rocks by the lighthouse. Baller. Oh, there's oh, another boat. boat. Going very fast. Is that a ghost ship? I don't know. Oh no, wait, oh. is that your sanity meter thing? Go away from the boat, like get into harbor fast. The oh ship. no. Oh no. sell first to they're still fresh oh fisherman have you run into a photographer on travels she talked here a few days ago for supplies no one says that one looked less interested but that boat is one of the horrors okay cool i suggest that she take some pictures of the town for promotional purposes but she didn't seem too interested she mentioned she was heading south perhaps you should introduce yourself Okay, cool. Uh, and yeah, I will go f so. Uh, will this just. Nope. It doesn't love me enough. Oh. It's fine, the other one just went to storage. I eat it. The fishmonger reaches book, a book. run to the counter and hands you a damp, battered book. A few shimmering fish scales are stuck to the cover. Fucked up, I love it. But yeah, I will, like... I will take hints on where things are... Whenever. Like, 
I I'm not smart. We know. <laughs> oh, thank you, Nosen, for gifting a sub. Also, everyone is so mean to me all the time. Did I leave my light on all night? Oh, close. Okay. That boat is one of the horrors. I thought maybe it was a friend. Also, this game auto saves, right? Cool. Love to catch blue mackerel. Saves when I hit dock? Okay. Oh, that's gonna be dredge. I don't have the tools for that yet. Uh, is, is my sanity reset? Does my sanity get reset and how do I tell? Probably Cyclopean like flounder. Oh. Fascinating. Fucked up. It's a fucked up specimen. The eye right below the clock? We are getting into the fucky wucky fish. And I, for one, am excited. Okay, so when I'm hunting for the grouper tonight, I want to go that way. Like the way that my camera is pointed. If there's an eye, my sanity is going bye bye. Okay. Not quite. This way? All right, cool. I think I get it. Cabin. Oh yes, encyclopedia. Show the fishmonger. Well, I was gonna do that anyway. No more towards the lighthouse? Okay. Sleeping in bright lights will reset sanity. Okay. You hand the grotesque fish to the fishmonger. He grins, raising the fish up to his face before inhaling a deep, stuttering breath. Well, whoops. He runs his fingers firmly along the length of the fish, as though feeling for something. He pushes from one side of its stomach, and a small shape can be seen against the bulging scales. Sikari says, Cap claimed by the ocean, went down with the ship. He slices the fish open. From its stomach, he pulls a small piece of fabric and spreads it on the counter. It's a delicately patterned handkerchief. Cap, Cap, Cap. Oh, no sense says, as all good captains should. Sage nodding. I can't believe Captain fucking died. I, I, I guess I tried to. Well, I've never seen that before in all my days. I'll give you this thing and I'll pay you for the fish too, of course. 
It's not the first corrupted fish I've seen in these parts, so I'm sure you'll find more before too long. I'll pay you well if you find any more. Can we dredge him back up? I don't have the equipment for that yet. Um... Send that to storage. Fishmonger wants fucked up fish, sissy Kari. Mischief says he's becoming one with the oarfish. I'm not sure if they're talking about the fishmonger or cap. A man is looking at you through your cabin window. His face is mostly in shadow. I know what you took to the fishmonger. Was that not the fishmonger? And I'll be clear. I know he extracted an artifact from it. I need to inspect it, but not here. Meet me on Blackstone Isle. Head out of this bay and cut south. I have a business proposition that you'll want to hear. I'll be waiting. Okay, let me... And this to the cabin, I guess. Or to the cargo. I'm so smart. Okay, where is the... He was talking about Black Isles? Which thing is Black Isles in? Or Blackstone Isle, okay. To the south. Oh, here, it's marked. I'm so smart. I guess I go there for now. This game is pretty good at marking roughly where you need to go next. Yes, I'm just stupid because I haven't gotten enough sleep. Okay, I assume that's Blackstone Isle there. And I think I figured out the trouble I'm having with the controls. I don't think that'll make me any better at it, but I know what the problem is, I think. Um, oh, I do have a story. I have a somewhat relevant story to tell you guys. I'm back, but mom is making me do chores at half past midnight. Captain, I'm so sorry. <laughs> is this the dock? Can I, can I dock here? I'm scared of getting too close. Workshop. The workshop looks as though it hasn't been used in decades. You enter, taking a moment to let your eyes adjust to the dim light. You find some horrifying creations among the detritus. I'm still mad that that's how you pronounce it. Wait, where did that go? Did that disappear? Am I going crazy? You can return to these items later. I'm gonna put it back. We will come back to this. The man is standing in a doorway watching you approach. He's holding an old book in one hand. It's bound in crimson with silver ribbons. You came. Good. Allow me to introduce myself. I am a collector of many things. Art and artifacts, treasures and truths, and curios that occupy the periphery of desire. And you have something for me. You give the handkerchief to the collector. He holds it up to the flickering light and studies it. <laughs> Mischief says, my name is Jonah Magnus. These patterns are unmistakable, even after all this time. This handkerchief comes from an old ship I've been searching for. 
It sank many years ago. It carried items of great importance. As you can imagine, retrieving them is proving to be challenging. That's where you come in. My proposition is this. I will outfit your vessel with equipment that will let you dredge the wrecks and dark depths. Find me these lost relics and I will reward you in ways beyond all imagining. This guy is going to turn us not human. I mean, I guess I'm making an assumption that we're human, but assuming that we're human, I think this guy is going to turn us not human. I'm not against this, to be clear. I just think he should be more upfront about it. I return. You need not give up your fishing career. I'll merely okay. need a f Sorry, I was already voicing this guy. <laughs> you can have him, you can have him. Just no response, just like ignores me and kept going like, okay. My processing, Damn. my processing speed is bad right now. <laughs> Hi, no, I love you. You suspect this guy and not the mayor? I suspect both of them. I'm poly suspicious. <laughs> I'm poly skeptical. Uh, I'll merely need a few hours with your vessel to make the necessary alterations. What do you say? Mm, I guess I accept. An excellent decision. I'll prepare the equipment immediately. The relics we're looking for are a ring, a necklace, a watch, a music box, and a key. I would encourage you to ask around the towns about shipwrecks or other strange occurrences. Anything that might be worth investigating. I did check the storehouse out. I decided to leave the stuff in there for now. Or the, the, yeah, the workshop. I knew what you meant. Return when you have something. Cool. Oh, I can sleep here. Pursuits. Search for relics. Oh, it tells me where the things are. Yay. Or, like, where, where, what general direction to look for them in. I appreciate that. That's cool. Should I go get the fish? I'm gonna go get the fish. I have my light on, leave me alone! Ah, okay. Hey, what's that glowing thing? No, so should I be worried about the glowing thing? Glowing thing tends to indicate mutations. Cool. And the ship is not interested in me, so I'm just gonna ignore it for right now. They're friends. I want this fish. Are you hearing this shit? What, the, like, whispering? That wasn't whispering, that was Edie knocking everything off my desk. Oh! I thought you meant in the game. Nope. Host eel. Cool. Host eel. Grey eel. Alright, I'm gonna head back. <laughs> Existential Terror says, oh, a parasite. Uh, I have, I have been out too late. I'm gonna, go get the grouper. Final, go get the grouper. And don't crash. I'm not gonna crash. I've already crashed. I figured out something slithers into my cargo hold. Oh, fuck yeah. Fun! Ooh. Oh, dear. Infected. Infected. I guess it's probably too late for the grouper now. Oh. Well, I tried and I succeeded. Yay. The eye is turning purple. Okay. Thanks. 
Well, at least it's not blue, because if it was blue, I'd have to blame Rupert. Yeah, I'm going to the fishmonger. Right, and I didn't tell my story. That's crows. I like this. What a fun game. Friends. Great eel lost to the birds. That's a mechanic? Okay. Please tell me it was the infected one. You know, I don't know. Yes. It was! You didn't- uh, Magnet Lattice is oh nice, I didn't miss all of Orphish Day Dredge. Uh, you have not missed, missed Orphish Day Dredge. We haven't even gotten the quest to get the Orphish yet. Yes. I do have fish for that order. Um, but Nocent is helping me progress. I, I assume that this is the, the progression for it. Didn't think you had it in you. Night fishing is a tall order. Magnet Lattice says get length mindset. In meaning to talk to you about new business venture I've been considering. Crab pots. I've only got one here for you, in fact. It's a bit banged up, but you could get it fixed at the shipwright. I can figure this out, sure. Should be pretty straightforward. Just drop it out to sea, anywhere. Then come back after a day or two to check in on it. I've got a customer after a fiddler crab and a common crab. Both species can be found around here. Okay, and how much are more? Oh, they last for a certain amount of time. Okay. Hundred dollars each. I feel No, like... that was you get one No no no, that was when you get one to two crabs per day. And they last three days. Two days. But they could be fixed. Repair repair it, fishmonger. A shipwright. shipwright, okay. I was gonna be like, I don't think the fishmonger can repair it. He just said he couldn't. Repair all. Don't forget to sell your fishies. I don't sell my fishies. I'm so professional. Right, I don't have anything of that yet. Alright, let's talk to these guys. Lighthouse keeper. Do you know of any shipwrecks around here? She eyes you suspiciously. Hmm. There's a spot near the back of Greater Morrow where the current catches in wreckage from the sea. Some nights you can see an uh, unnatural glow rising from that patch of dark water. Can't imagine what's down there in the deep. So if you're looking for what I think you're looking for, it's best you just move on. Have you heard of any strange things happening? I see plenty of strange things from atop the lighthouse. Sometimes I don't know whether or not I can trust my own eyes. She holds the lantern up so that it shines brightly onto your face. Are you really standing here in front of me? Or is this just another of the folks' tricks? Actually, I'm standing behind you. Nothing personnel, kid! Teleports behind you. Bites you. Who lives Hi, on Blackstone Isle? I see a lot from up here, you know. Saw that ill-fated boat return. I chose to look the other way. I watched an unnatural glow flicker through those windows. Whatever you've got planned, I hope you know what you're doing out there. 
Samu said Moth is the most professional. Sikari said Moth is the most professional. And Existential Terror said professional. And also, fun energy from this lightkeeper. Have the feeling she's bad at her job. <laughs> Lighthouse well, on during she the just day. let you crash. To be fair, that was my own incompetence. I don't think there's anything she could have done. Builder. You approach a woman sitting on the dockside, staring out to sea. She turns to you. What's it like out there? It's difficult. It's gotta be a damn sight better than this bloody town. I think I just need to get away for a while. Maybe not come back. I support you. Going backwards is a mistake, don't you think? You should always be moving forward. Moving along. Sometimes you have to move backwards to get away from the rocks that you almost crashed into. <laughs> anyway. I can't go back. She's gazing out to sea again, lost in thought. Say, if you find me some materials, maybe you can help me move. I mean, really move. There's an island I heard about, Seal Point, just to the north. Two units of lumber and two units of scrap is all I need. I can make a new place for myself out there. You'd be welcome to visit, too. Just stack it up at Steel Point when you have everything. I'll pay you when the job's done. Cool. I can do that, I think. I assume I can do all these things. Surely they wouldn't ask me to do something I can't do. Crabs. Edie is sitting between me and my screen. She's just sitting there. She is helping. You helping, Bubba? Select the crab pot ability with button and deploy one with axe. Okay, now does that mean shoulder or trigger? Oh, okay. Baller. Okay. And and they said around here, right? Do I drop these in the shallows or do I go out a, a touch? Uh The way I know crab nets is that they tend to be dropped by the docks themselves, but I don't know if that game will be like that. They tend to be in the shadows of the rocks, because that's where crabs like to be, but they can also be dropped in the deep because they just kind of ever everywhere. Depends yeah, the kind crabs. of pots you have. It really depends the kind of pots yeah, you gonna, have. I'm gonna and drop I have no it idea here. what kind of pot you have. Watch where it is. If it says plenty, you're good. Cool. Uh... Ooh, we have a spyglass and a foghorn. Um... Okay. Uh, I assume Steel Point is one of the places marked on my map, but I'm not sure which one. Uh, press your map button. The northern she one? She said to the north. Okay. Uh, I will head north. Uh, what's, what's the other thing that's marked on my lap? Also, Sikari says, we have a foghorn, do we have a leghorn? The other thing marked on your map is when you asked about where shipwrecks are. Ah, thank you. So that's where you get the scrap, and then up here is where you put the scrap. Okay. That would be the key? Hello. What are you doing? Do you want they to say hi? They don't have scrap. Okay. Did you hear that? Good girl. Press X to 
change things and avoid gaps. That's fun. Pearl earrings. Was that one of the things we needed? You can check. I don't love that they thrust... This is sellable antiques? Okay. I don't love that they thrust me into the mini game without any preamble, um, but I did enjoy the mini game. Okay, and I don't have any materials yet. Where do we get materials? That wasn't what I meant to do. Are you saying hi again? No, she doesn't want to say hi. You want to say hi? You see that disturbed water ahead of you? Over here? Yeah, that's the scraps, because they're like rectangles on top of the water. I love the little iridescence on the wind. Search part. All right. Bolt of cloth. Oops. I can do this. I can Bro. do this. There we go. No, listen, I'm fine. I just got into a bad rhythm and needed to stop and reset. Hello, whatever you are. Go back, there's two other bits there. All right, I'll go back after I get this. Many-eyed mackerel. Uh, right. New fish, and I back just came list. New Come fish on, what? Funny. I said new fish added to kin list. <laughs> That's a TBH creature, says Kriber. Fish. It is. Um, I'm going behind the bit. rock. Yes. I'd many curls, says Absemu. I think just many curl will work, honestly. Well, you gotta get the eyes in there. Yes, somewhere. you should. Make, you should make popcorn. I just finished my popcorn, so you should have some. Okay. You said there was one more? Oh. Shiny. Goblet. Goblet. Okay, I'm gonna go rest. Oh, god, the rocks really do pop up out of you. fishing pole. Cool. Rest. Material pile. Lumber. It's 
a very weird dick and balls. Okay, and the other thing I'm looking for is metal scraps. Cool. I can put it in the wrong way up? It wasn't the wrong way up, it was fully, like, perpendicular. That's the wrong way up. You're the wrong way up. No. Uh, I want to go back and check on the crab pot because I've been out for a couple days, I think. Uh, and I'm worried that it's just going to, like, disintegrate. I'm not going the right way, am I? That is kind of what happened. Uh, no, you're not. Check the map. Perpins, you're dicular, says Sikari. Listen, I'm doing my best. Uh, right, I had a story I wanted to tell. This may take me a while to tell it because I will keep getting interrupted by game mechanics. Um, but when I was a kid, probably in middle school, maybe in elementary school, um, my extended family went to a seafood restaurant. And the menu had something on it that was like a, a disclaimer that said, occasionally pearls may be found in oysters and bones and fish. And I, being a small child, was like, well, I want to get the oysters, because I want a chance at getting a pearl. And everyone around me was like, no, that's stupid. That's never going to happen. Also, you've never had oysters, and you don't even know if you like them. Uh, so I sulked a little, and I got something else. But my grandfather got the oysters and had misunderstood. What is that? Oh, that's my crab thing. Why do I feel like your grandfather's going to be upset that he didn't get bones in the oysters? I have crabs. <laughs> well, the man who um, gave me crabs in Baltimore. <laughs> I do have crabs for that order. Congrats, don't you mean congrabs? Congrabs. No one says, ah, but is it Miss Baltimore crabs? And Ipsemu says, how did a crab pot that takes two inventory spaces catch a crab that takes up more than two? That's the dark magic of this game. And crab also existential terror like says crab cat. <laughs> crab pots don't always work by trapping them inside. Sometimes they work by trapping the crab's claws. I have one final request for you. As you've seen, some fish around here can develop odd uh, deformities. What do you think happens to a person that eats the flesh of one of these mutants? Why does he get sick? Well, perhaps. But I want to know for sure. Bring me a mutant fish. Any will do. Just keep this between the two of us. Have you got any of those mutants with you now? Remember, any apparent will suffice. I suspect they're all the same, underneath. The fishmonger takes the aberrated fish from you. He clutches it close to his chest, wringing his hands around its slimy body. Sikari is ch ch chanting Innsmouth. <laughs> yes. This should do nicely. Here's what the fish is worth. Why don't you take these two? They're of no use to me. Mm. Do you hear that? It sounds like the faintest whispering. You listen. Silence. In the stillness of the room, the fishmonger's hands begin to tremble. His face grows anguished. Please. Tell what you need and then leave. I'm still with this quickler. Creature. Quickly it's now. Quickler. It's quickler. Okay, I've just got the one crab, right? Where do I sell my treasure? 
at the other guy in the other island. Oh, the trader? The, um, yeah, the antique guy. The fishmonger's door slams behind you. You hear the heavy scraping of a metal bar sliding across it. Fascinating. Ah. If you're wanting to get a bit more out of your oranges, take a look at this book on the house. She pulls a book from a toolbox nearby and hands it to you. A few of the pages are stuck together with grease. Ew. Wait, what just... Big fancy rod. Oh, I put it in storage. Cool, okay. It's like, I accidentally pressed a button and it fucking disappeared. Flexible fishing uh -oh. pole. I can't afford that. Can I afford it if I sell my other things? 75. I can't do math. I think that comes out too. I could use the space and I th think I can afford it. Yes. Can't afford anything else right now, that's fine. Uh, cabin. Oh, uh, Strouds will real fish in 10% of her Cool. Let's read this one. Encyclopedia, thank you. Research. Volcanic. Hydraulic rod. Hmm. Do we want mangrove or do we want volcanic? We don't know a reason. I guess I feel yet, so I feel wait. comfortable assuming. Ignore those right now. Okay. That's what I said. Go for engines or. <gasps> I didn't even notice. Ah. <laughs> Ugh! Okay, uh, fish and crab pot, hardy crab pot, large crab pot. And then engines, improved outboard engine. Ikari, don't say that. Not while I'm here. <laughs> Uh, and I'm related to you, so I'm screenshotting that and sending it to my <coughs> friend. <laughs> um, right, I'm gonna head across here. Uh, so, uh, my grandfather got the oysters and mis had misunderstood what the whole thing was about. Um, and assumed that I just wanted to try oysters. So he gave me one of his. And I was eating it. Was chewing on it. And I felt something hard between my teeth. And I reached into my mouth and I pulled it out. And you will never fucking guess what it was. A pearl? It was. Christ. And the- my family was like, what the fuck? Uh, the waiters were coming over, like, never in our entire time working here. Everyone was all really excited about it. And I was just like, I told you so. And I kept eating my oyster. And yeah. I felt something hard between my teeth. Another one? And I pulled it out, and you'll never fucking guess what it was. A pearl? It was a second pearl. Oh my god. Okay, and I just sell all of these. Welcome. Found anything special lately? Yay, love to have money. Um, yeah, I, I still have them somewhere. I think I put them in a box. Um, grieving Father. Do you know of any shipwrecks around here? A 
Well, yes, you see, my only son was lost at sea some years ago. Looks strangely like you. <laughs> He's still out there somewhere, in one of those wrecks. All alone in the cold, dark water. The man is clearly trying his hardest to remain composed, but tremors of grief rack his body. I think that's the wrong rack. He was wondering, I, I notice you have some dredging equipment installed on your vessel. If you're able to retrieve any of his belongings from the wreck, I think he'd feel more at peace with his mementos were here with me. He wore a bronze belt buckle, specially engraved. I'd recognize it anywhere. If there's a chance you could find it, I'd be in your debt. Anything else I can help you with? Do you know strange occurrences? I, I don't get out a lot anymore, so I don't see much of what goes on. But I do remember the old mayor in his final days. What an awful sight that was. Screaming and throwing things into the sea. Throw it back, he would cry over and over. Begging anyone who would listen, howling it to the wind. These days, I almost feel like I understand. Anything else? Okay, so... Oh, the little black dots are docks. Okay, I get it. Yes. Little black dots all over the linoleum. The eye is blue? I don't know, I'm just gonna go to bed. Zzz. Anyway, the pearls are both, they're really small and discolored, but I think that just makes them cooler. It does. Uh, map. So, the look he's giving me right now, I'm gonna send it bit. to you. God, this guy's sun crashed so close to home. That's fish. Ow, honestly. <sighs> he was as bad at this as I am. Find more lumber. Alright, was that not the spot I was supposed to be at? Where's the map? Oh, more this way. This game has something going on that doesn't feel quite like tank controls, but feels more like tank controls than I'm happy with. I am going fully the wrong way. Is that a shark? I don't know. Shark? You know that is a big fish. Let's catch it. Sharky, sharky, sharky! Just, I don't have the right equipment. Cringe. There's wildlife in the game as well? Neat. Yeah, I think I'm just lost. I'm gonna head back to the far away place and grab those metal scraps. I should get a better engine, but I'm scared. If I'm faster, I am more likely to crash into things, I think. I'm pretty sure that's how it works. If you're sure. I'll upgrade at some point. I, I mean, I know, I know I need to upgrade. I, I just, mm. it scares me. Get speedy. I will crash into things faster and with more energy. I 
you could use just one engine for detailed movement and two or more for long straightaways. I don't think that's how it works, but I could be wrong. overall speed. Okay. Fucking love boats, dude. And you're so right for that. I really do, though. They're awesome. And you're so right for that. Okay, I've got those scraps. Oh, there's more here. I think you can fit that one. You can, actually, I no, can, you can if you move the cloth. Yeah, I can do fridge Tetris. Like, this is not anywhere near efficient. The fish stream. Did I do a fishing stream? Oh yeah, we're on Haven. I just went into the irradiated zone and fished for a bit. <laughs> well, that is where the fishing spot is. I mean, yeah. I, I just feel like it's a good introduction to go into the irradiated oh, area and go fishing. 5% more movement speed than listed. Terrifying, thanks! But yeah, no, this this game has something that doesn't feel quite like tank controls, but is close enough to tank controls to keep throwing me, uh, is I think what's happening. You know, I wonder if that's in the settings. Go back to accessibility. No, it doesn't look like it. Yeah, turn- wait, no, that's the turning zone, dead zone. That's what that is. Oh my god. Right. I was in this- I was on this, um, kind of shitty public Minecraft server at one point. Uh, and I, I needed fish because I wanted cats, and all of the people on that server were selling cooked fish and not raw fish, which I think is unfair. Um, and I hate fishing in Minecraft, I'm not good at it, so Absum came on <laughs> and fished for me. And I thought that was very sweet. I still think it's very sweet. It was sweet. Oh, bonk. There's gotta be a more efficient way to touch whatever. You can take the stuff back and then quickly come back for the yeah. pot. I forgot to leave the scrap! Ah! Okay, I needed two scrap, right? I'm gonna go uh, give yes. the rest to the dock worker, or shipwright. Sanity, yeah. Yay! 
Yay! Oh, bye bye, Edie. Cat is gone. Okay, uh, I should put things in storage, probably. She put the two cloths away. Alright, storage, storage, storage. How's that fishmonger doing? Ugh. Blinding headache today. Did you come by yesterday? I, I don't recall. Anyway, what what can I do for you? Can't afford it yet. Alright, let's grab that pot real quick. That'll be nice to have. Okay, it's a model. Okay, so it looks point. like it's on the other side of Little Marrow. I don't know why I was so confused about that. Have you taken the scrap up the steel point yet? No, I'm about to do that. Okay. I'm just trying to figure out what's going on. You, you, you may have noticed that I'm not at the top of my game today. Really? I'm doing this for the Orfish. We want more fish, and we want some of those fish to be ore fish. What well, ore fish? Builder, no. I will do that. First, let me check the map. I'm gonna go behind Little Marrow because I know where I'm going. Quick note make sure you have whole space before ten telling the builder. Oh, uh, which, which thing is whole space? Your inventory space. Oh, okay. Like, a lot of it, or just any? Big boy. Big boy. Hey! Hello, friends. Two of them. Sikari says, Moth is not at the top of their game. One could say they're dredging the bottom, even. Orca! I think a lot about that little comic um, where s someone is asking an orca, so what kind of whale are you? And their lawyer is like, objection. <laughs> I 
That's a good one, actually. I haven't thought about that in a while. I think about it a lot. Uh, two by three? Two okay. by three. All right, I assume this is what we're looking for. I will guess. Bronze belt buckle. All right, let's go give that to the guy. This is exactly what sailing at night is like, by the way. Wow, you're so. Don't. Sure. Shard Ray. Cool. That's a fucked up looking guy. Where am I? Mm. This is why I don't want to upgrade my engine. Ooh, a painter. Uh, hello? Is everything okay? About that belt buckle. You give the belt buckle to the man. This is... This is his! Oh, thank you. Bless you. You've returned him to me. Please, take this. Uh, I've not any money to pay you, but this might hold some value to you. I can make some use of it. Is there anything else I can help you with? I better go. Alright, yikes. Uh, the fisherman. I had thought you might stop by. Welcome to my humble studio. If you're wanting to experiment with some decorations, yes, I'm the person to talk to. Okay, quick look at decorations. I can attach flags and bunting and add some style to your boat. I have a design here already that you might like. If you find any others on your travels, bring them back to me, and I can rig them up for you. <sighs> of course, I can also add a splash of color to your hull. I'm sorry to say that my selection of pigments is limited at the moment, though. Hmm. Thanks for a short while. Ah. The other day, down by the shoreline, I saw a strange crab with the most strikingly vibrant coloration. My knees aren't suited to clambering over rocks and chasing crustaceans, you see, but if you caught such a creature... He clears scraps of cloth and paper from his workbench, revealing a large pestle and mortar. With the right binding agent, we can grind them together for a new mixture. He turns back to you, a cunning plan formed in his mind. Hmm. Fisherman, bring me some of those strange crabs. They'll turn your vessel into a work of art. I like this guy. Ah, for now. What can I help you with today? Alright. Sleep, 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 sleep. Okay. We've got crabs and we've got the wreck behind the island. Existential Terror says, damn, this is just like in Homestuck. You want to grind up this crab just because he's a weird color? Well, he is a nice weird color.
missing two of the ring. Back this way. Jeez. I love how this game looks. This is one of those very pretty kind of games. It is really pretty. Okay, I think it's behind this rock. Rock. Hmm. There we go. I guess I might also want to grab some fish from over here. Or fish low percent, no engine upgrades. <laughs> Thanks, Obsemu. Relic discovery. Key. That's one we'll big key. key. That's that that's a big key. Okay, I'm gonna head back. I'm gonna pick up my pot. Why is that key bigger than my engine? Don't worry about it. Actually, it's I should friendship. turn in the key. That's a keyblade? It is a keyblade, you're so right. Please don't run into the rocks. Oh, that was something. You enter the collector's house. He's standing at the back of the room, still holding the silver and crimson book. He seems impatient. I thought you were doing this guy. No, you can take him. I don't know the voice you did. Oh, I was I was doing like a quasi Batman, I think. Well <laughs> you have something, don't you? <laughs> Show me. Ooh, I got an achievement. You hand him the key. Ooh. The cold metal shimmers a strange shine as he holds it. The shape of the key, the teeth, the head, now seem some now somehow seem changed, smaller. Has it always been this way? Hmm. Is this all? Where is the lock? The collector grows agitated. It seems. The pieces we're looking for have traveled further than I anticipated. Much further, I suspect. In that case, allow me to aid your travels. He turns a few pages in his book and mutters something low under his breath. A burst of light fills your vision, and you stagger Ooh. back briefly. Hey, dude, consent! Now go. We have more relics to uncover. No sin- what is the shimmery that's happening over to the left? That's the red stuff I was talking about, with the beacon! No, the beacon was different. Yeah, but that's the same stuff. That's the stuff Isn't that the lighthouse keeper was talking about. Yeah. No, Sid, can I go investigate that or am I gonna die? That's a wisp. That's oh. a wisp? What? I'll die then. Okay. My intuition tells me that the current may have carried some debris southeast, towards Gale Cliffs. Make that your priority. I'll mark the location on your map where you can begin your search. The words you read from that book, Anything what did else? they do to me? This book holds power from the deep. I merely extended its powers towards you. Is there one in particular you wish to know more about? Not really! Anything else? Right, uh, sleeping. I can also research. Complex crab pot. Fun. 
Okay, sleep. Moth saved the game and touched the thingy. I don't want to right now. I'm busy. Um. Haste to add speed to your engines, but increases panic and engine heat. Engine heat mechanic. Okay. Good That's to know, I, I guess. Avoiding. Don't forget to sell your fishes. They're going off. I'm gonna go sell my fishes. Sell them faster. You can neutralize wisps by sp switching your lights off. If they're red, they're a danger. If they're white, well, your sanity is going to suffer, but not as much as if the wisp attacks you. The first time I played Unforgiving in Northern Hymn, uh, I saw a light and I went, oh, that's a wisp. One of my friends was sitting with me and said, what? No, go check it out. And I was like, that's a wisp. If I go over there, I'm going to fall into the fucking bog and die. And my friend was like, what are you talking about? No. Um... And I was like, listen, look, I'll show you. And I went over to the wisp. And I fucking died. Hee <laughs> I know my wisps. Wisps are good. The lighthouse keeper emerges from the dark forest that flanks the town. She walks towards the dock with a confused look on her face. Oh, it's you. Who were you expecting? Your engine, it sounds like... I'm sorry. I mistook it for the vessel of an old friend. Dejected, she turns and walks back towards the lighthouse. Okay. Fishmonger. Lousy weather lately. Almost makes you not want to get out of bed. But you and I, we've got to do it, eh? We are what keeps people from going hungry. I didn't sell anything I wasn't supposed to sell, right? Right. No. Ah. You've done it? Oh, well, no sense in wasting time. Let's get moving. No room on deck. Come back when you have space. <laughs> Sorry, I wasn't done here. There's other things I need. Wait, the cerebral crab was for the painter? I was gonna go drop my cra drop my crab pots over that way. I'm uh, not you'll, smart sometimes. You'll get another one. Halogen spotlight. Neat. Oh, those are white. Okay, now let's go. You've done it! Get on my boat! Good riddance, you great tomorrow. I'm onward bound. Basically, any mutant crab can be used to make paint. Oh, okay. I'm not a clever man. Just different colors. It seems unsanitary to put a whole ass living human being in the same hold where you keep your catches, says it's Samu. Well, listen, I don't tell you how to do your job. And that is kind of how they do it, though. The fish are just kind of on the floor in the pots and the people walk around them. I used to watch Deadliest Catch, by which I mean I used to sit in a room while Deadliest Catch was playing and just scroll on tumblr so i feel like i absorb probably a non-zero amount of things but not much i think mostly I what i absorbed is that crabbing is so fucking dangerous why do people do it and also it really is is the camera crew safe i worry about the camera crew yes 
Yes, this'll do. Thank you, fella. Give me a short while to get things built here. You're welcome back anytime. Do you have a tent? She reaches into her toolbox and pulls out a handful of components. Yeah. Take these. Always good to have on hand. But but seriously, do you have a tent? I didn't think this through. No, sorry. Uh, uh, oh. Bye. Uh, okay. Oh, oh uh, bye. Bye. I don't have a boat or a tent or a... You asked me to light. bring you here. No refunds. <laughs> Not even a flint and steel. Oh, oh. Oh, he can't hear me. Obsemu says, if I recall correctly, camera crew members have been injured during shooting. I forget if any of them have died. Man. That sucks. I'm going the wrong way. I don't know why I always assume it's... Go back to the back of Steel Point? Why am I going to the back of Steel Point? That was a fish is all? The crabs, I mean. I do like a crab. There's things there. There's okay. things there. I do like when there's things there. What? Why am I being yelled at? <laughs> Orfish! Oh, Mischief says, Moth, there's an Orfish comic on my dash. I'm gonna go the other way. <laughs> no, you should go into it. I don't want to. Go towards the light. It's you National Orfish Day! I have no good options. Uh, mm. uh, X. We are going away. Going. I'm using haste. Yeah, but where are you going? Away! You need to get to a dock, dude. I'm panicking. Leave me alone. Check your map. Hang on. I need to turn my lights back on, I think. You are on. Oh, right. Oh, God. Oh, boy. Okay. What is that? Oh. Huh? Check your map. Okay. Just keep going around the island. Follow the shore. Are we good or should I reload? Oh, just keep going. How did I survive that? I don't know. You're gonna crash. There you go. No, since says, huh, that might be the first time I've seen that. Hello? Oh, I'm not doing so hot, huh? Just get into the dock here and then you can go across the bay once it's daytime. How did I survive that? No idea. Welcome! Found anything special lately? Okay. I'm gonna undock briefly and drop my crab pot. You should have a head over to the other end of the bay as well. To, um... I am still, like, repair. hallucinating. Um, yeah. No, you're right, I'll head over. Sorry, will I be okay right now? Yes. What was that? Just go, just go, just go, just go. My ship is on fire! Vamanos. Christ! Just 
Just aim directly at the dock. No scent, no scent. <laughs> no scent, I'm scared. Go. Okay, that's most of my money, so I don't love that, but... Research. I should. I should get a better engine. No sense says it's not a horror game if you don't experience the horrors. Listen, I'll experience the horrors. I just don't... <laughs> I need a better engine to outrun the horrors, yes. Okay. It's day. My eye looks... Okay, you wanted me to go to the back of Steel Point? You might as well wait for tomorrow now. Like, get some fishing done today. Because by the time you get there, it's going to be night time. I wanted to see the fucking... the map. Huh? I can also dock over there. I forgot about that. <laughs> Sorry, the game just changed a lot really fast. I should go look at the lighthouse? There's pretty words if you look at the lighthouse. I'll deal with it when I get back, I think. If you go closer to it, you'll get an interaction option. Yeah, I'm gonna have to head back that way anyway. I'm gonna go dock, and that's gonna be fine. You built a fucking house, Christ. Ah. Hey, thanks again for helping move out, move, move out here. I've managed to get myself set up now. I found this while I'm packing. You should take it. She hands you a book. The cover is dusty, but otherwise in good condition. If you ever need to use a dock or the. Listen, we know it's. <laughs> Listen. Pursuits. Okay, the only thing I have active is search for relics. Okay. My storage is interconnected no matter where I am. Baller. I'm getting a good night's sleep. Big honk, me, me, me. I do love an under chest. I love an under chest. Cloth. No. Nope. Okay. Keep space in your hold for going around the back. Yeah. You mean over this way, right? I believe so. Hello, fishies. Yeah, there's a cabin thing.
my left. No, a bit less left. Oh, yes. SOS. Well. I'm saved. Saved. Oh, you are a sight for these sore eyes. What happened? I washed up here. Oh, it must be some two weeks ago now. We were in rough seas, and then a wave hit us broadside, and I was jostled overboard and swept away. <laughs> I thought my crew would have come to find me by now, but yours is the first ship I've seen pass by here. Did the boy send you looking for me? Sorry, man. They? Oh. Well, I'm sure they're out there looking anyways. Can you get me to Little Marrow, stranger? I should be able to catch them when the next stop by. Yeah. We can take you. Fun. One thing I never see people do, like both in real life and in media and stuff, you're meant to destroy the SOS sign when you get saved, so that other people don't stop. But that they always sense. just leave it there. You know, I always assumed they were in a hurry. I mean, yeah, but like, when they get saved, they tend to have like... If it's an emergency, they'll get driven back and then someone else will be called out to destroy it. But this isn't an emergency. That guy's fine. No sense has also horror movie setups. Yeah. Wait, am I going to the right place? Yes. You can't rob us of our horror movie setups. That's also, now I'm thinking about it, that is an untapped scenario for horror movie things. For someone to stop that by an SOS really sign good. that's been that's been already sorted out, and then they get trapped in the horrors. Oh, hello, Kit Kit. Do you want to go? The sweet rank smell of civilization. I thought I could never miss it. He turns to you. For someone who has just been saved, he seems gloomy. I've not got much on me, as you can imagine, and I'm feeling this isn't worth much anymore. For me, at least. But perhaps it's worth something for you. Research part. He removes a signet ring from his left hand and presses it into yours. It's emblazoned with a symbol of a captain's wheel. On to better horizons, friend. Farewell. Cool. Pursuit resolved. Oh, what do I have in my hold? I think I'd sleep and go back. Bye bye, girly. This is a good gameplay loop. It is. Okay, interact with the lighthouse, you said? I think you just look at it. Oh, that's lightning. The sparkles? The spa what spar- Oh! Oh! Watch me navigate these rocks, like- I don't want to say like a pro because I'm not, but like someone nah, who's not crashing. But like someone who's not crashing into them. The lighthouse towers above. Waves crash endlessly against the perilous rocks below. All creatures, human or otherwise, would have their brittle bodies broken and thrown at its feet. You ponder the intrinsic power of this structure, a vast column of stone shouldering the responsibility of countless lives. How long will it stand? How long until it decays into ruin, its purpose exhausted? The lighthouse towers above. Damn. And I didn't crash on the rocks. Yet. 
Why are you so mean to me all the time? <laughs> I do like the words. And I'm going They're in this direction. Whee! Writing in this game is good. Okay, that off in the distance to the left a little bit is where I'm trying to go, right? I believe so. Bit more to the right? Ah. Oh yeah, I think you're heading for the big ones in the distance. The white silhouette. No, I got what you meant. No, since says, ooh, you're probably about to, you're about to meet probably my favorite character in this game. Epistemic status, lie, all the characters in this game are my favorite. No, since I love you. No, since the one who bought me this game, for the record. Fuck you. Bonuses. Equipment types that use durability will lose it 10% slower. Cool. There's two dots. This one seems slightly closer, so let's go for it. Ooh, the waves look so pretty. Waves are pretty. Fucking love the oh, ocean. Oh, Nosen says they were gonna advise me to go for this one. I know how this game works. It does the beacon. Or at least I know how I work, and I tend to go left first. Yeah, the beacon is a different thing. Those look different. I love the ocean. Okay. Dock? Dock? Is this a dock? Is this... They look different. Oh. Hi there. You're a new phase of fish when I take it. Perfect. Well, we should get along like a house on fire. <laughs> Love the voice you gave her. Um, I'm a traveler and a merchant, all rolled into one. If you have any fish to sell, I'll take them on board and sell them at the next town I come across. <laughs> Likewise, I hold a small cargo of equipment between places. You're welcome to peruse the stock if you see if there's anything that takes your fancy. Come and see me when you're ready to trade. Thank you. I enjoy Fresh doing market. voices. On this side of the platoon, I'll buy any fish you want to sell. I also keep a stock of crab bots here for sale. Say, have you met the photographer? She stopped by my pontoon a little while back. She's loaded up with fancy camera equipment to take pictures of all the wildlife. She sighs <sighs> wistfully. I wish I had my own camera. Wouldn't it be nice to document everything you do? You'd never forget anything. Anyway, she said she was setting up on a small island to the south of the Marrows. If you're in the area, maybe you should check on her. Shipyard. Most of this gear is super heavy, so I don't offload it at every pontoon. But come aboard and see what equipment I've got for sale. How much is that? 200. Okay. Mm. Dry docks. <laughs> you might get used to the dry docks at other ports, but we can make the same. I don't We're... know, I tried to read it off stream instead. It's fine, it's fine. Oh. Hey again, come by for a chat. Do you need help with anything? 
assistance from an angler? Absolutely. I've been trying to collect records of where species of fish located. I figured out most of them when I travel so far, but there are a few I haven't been able to track down. Reckon you could share your info with me? Sure, I can help with that. Great! Yes! The fish I've left to track down are oarfish, gulper eel, goliath tigerfish, and the coelacanth. Coelacanth? Coelacanth. Coelacanth. I know a little about these species already, so maybe I can point you in the right direction. Hmm. What do you want to know? Tell me about oarfish! Tell me fish. about oarfish! Given that the oarfish has a long and fragile body, I suspect they'll live in reasonably deep but calm water. Maybe the shelter of the gale cliffs would suit them? What about the other fish? I don't, don't care, care about the other fish. Anything else you want to talk about? Oh, okay. Alright. So, what, which... Fine, we can ask about the gulper eel. Oh, I again, warn come by you for a chat. That there's a thing living in the cliffs, says no sin. Hmm. Tell yeah, me about the gulper oarfish. eels. I know that gulper eels live in the in deepest depths imaginable. You'll have to get some specialist gear to catch one of those. What about the other fish? I don't care about the other fish. Anything else you want to talk? Okay. Okay. Come again. What gear do I need to catch the oarfish? Like, wh which fishing rod I do I need, I guess? She didn't say anything about specialist equipment, so maybe... It kind of just said deep. It did just say deep. Where's the encyclopedia? Oh, there it is. Cliffs. Fun. Go to the cliffs. No, in the axe be there. Okay. Yells at you. Cliffs. Yells at you, yells at you, yells at you. Cliffs. Oh never mind, it's not showing you yet. Yeah, no one no one tells me anything. Not me. That looks like a message in a bottle. It'll be under exotic, okay. I need an abyssal rod, okay. I am going to continue playing the game. No scent, can you find for me what the like quickest route to getting that is? Are you tired? Me? Yeah. Not really, are you? No. Oh. Okay, well, I was curious and I satisfied my curiosity. Fair enough. Quest bit. Oh. An old man emerges from one of the nearby broken buildings and hobbles towards you. Ah. Did Captain die again? I... No, I'm here. I'm just deciding on a voice. Okay. I have not been up since. I took a nap, okay? <laughs> I took a nap. I slept yeah, for, for less than a, I slept less for half an hour, hour I'm good. Yeah. Oh, uh, greetings. Don't get many visitors around here. What is it you need? This place doesn't seem safe. Why do you live here? I have been stubbornly holding out here for quite some time. Truth be told, I've been reconsidering my position lately. I have been happy here for so long. My wife and I had such a beautiful life. Until the collapse. Oh. Now I'm alone. And cut off by land and sea. Left only with these trembling rocks on all sides. I could help you move it's to Ingfell. It's not that simple. My brother would never. You see, I used to live in Ingfell with my brother. He was a whaler back in the day. Things were bad. We fought a lot, mostly about how our parents' inheritance should be divided. We are in the prime foolishness of our youth. When my wife and I decided to move here, I took the family crest. I stole it from him. Now, after all this time, I can't return without it. Where is it? That's where the problem lies. After the collapse, that creature. It dragged debris from the houses down into its wretched burrows. 
crest went down with it. Debris. Did I say debris? You what? said you. It's debris, and you said debris. It's debris. Okay. You, if you're allowed to say boy, or whatever the fuck it is you say. The fucking boy. Buoy, that's what you fucking say. It's a boy. Bully? So I'm allowed to say debris. I'll bite you. I've yeah, only ever boy. heard buoy. Chat, chat way on on Americans, this. Americans, Amer Americans say buoy. It is a boy. So if you're no sentence with to cat. Buoy, I'm allowed to say debris. Fine. Anyway, I'll look for the thing. I didn't even read. It's a lost cause. You, but thank you. Please be careful. Well, I'm only slightly damaged. It's early in the day. Creatures no. there. Okay, stellar basin. You said. You'd like it. Shortcut this by going to D5. Cool, okay. D5. Alright. Let's go for it. But I want to see the inside. The inside of what? The Stella Basin. Oh, avoid the center of stellar, base, stellar Basin, no matter how pretty it looks. You can't see it. Which way am I going? Due west. Oh, you can see it, just don't yeah, sail over it. Also, probably repair first. Everyone is so mean to me all the time. Can I repair here? I don't see why not. Looks like it's a dry dock. It's not. No. Damn. Fine. I'll head back over here. Sikari says, I guess there's an argument for the boy pronunciation, considering that it's not pronounced buoyant. Alright, fix me up. I think I'm gonna go via Blackstone Isle even though it's gonna take longer because I need somewhere to spend the night. Don't you have the haste thing? I do, but I don't like using it. Uh. Shot. 
Overshot. Overshot. Alright, this should do it. We're so close! It is nearly orfish time. <laughs> the stone hums quietly, sending ripples through the air around it. Faint shapes dance upon its surface, vanishing before your eyes can focus on them. I'm going to come back to this later. Okay, hello, Ach Doc. Hello, Doc. Hello, hello Doc. Hello, again. Friend, Doc, a friend. I knew you well. Our common goal. Was we <laughs> existential terror says we're here for orfish, not lore fish. I'm just saying shit. The lore is good too, obviously. Yeah, the lore is good. I th I think I have to continue streaming this game. Um, but for today we are going to stop. Uh, when or fish. All right, D five. D five. This should. Need a trawl net. Where, how do oh. I get a trawl net? I assume from the upgrades lady? Well, I think I'm gonna need something to sell. I need to research nets, but first I need the net spaces. Okay. Don't forget about your crab pots if you have any out. Hmm, I do. Um, but I don't want to deal with that right now. Fair enough. Three-headed cod. Cool. Good to know. Don't call it that. <laughs> Blue mackerel. Fishmonger. Nice. Okay. Dry dock. Okay, I need you wood have and two cloth. cloth. Do storage. I have wood in storage? No. No. Okay, so I need to go dredge something else up. There should probably be a wood in the bay here. I don't know. I don't see anything. It's the rectangle ones. So, like, they're all floating, and then they're different shapes, and you're looking for ones that are rectangle. They're different shapes. I am. I think it's behind you, the rectangular ones. Look in the other side of the rocks. The bay between the marrows? Oh, there's some. Unless that's cloth, but I think that's wood. I mean, this looks like dredge. It's wood, yeah.
All right, let's go back. Also leave my various components in the upgrade slots. Yeah, I know. Have I said how much I love boats yet? Because I fucking love boats. No, you haven't. You should ocean. tell us more. I love them. I love being on boats. Okay, fishmonger first. Really. Nosen asks, what is your favorite boat? Sikari asks, how many boats have you been on? Uh, a lot. If you want me to list the famous ones, I can, but it's, it's just been a lot of boats. Uh... Oh goodness, can I remember the name of it? Basic There's Tomo. one down in Portsmouth Dock. No, Portsmouth Navy Dockyard. What's that boat called? Okay, how much is I'm quickly googling it. I can see it in my head. It's this one where they, um... I've completely reconstructed it, but you can go down an elevator and you can walk along a um, kind of... Uh, so you can see the outside of the hull from underneath. Like, it's completely... Uh, the Mary Rose. I assume I get rid rose. of rot? Yeah, probably. Oh, left trigger. It's called the Mary Rose. I've also been on the Victory, which is in the same place. But, um, Ports... Okay. If you search Portsmouth, Mary Rose. Like, Portsmouth, Mary Rose. Mary Rose. It's a very beautiful ship. I, I love it a lot. And you'll see in the pictures okay. what I mean about how it's like suspended. And it's. You can walk along all the different layers of it, and I love it. I haven't been on that boat, but that's probably my favourite boat that I've been to see. My favourite boat I've been on has actually just been like a little. little rowing boat. So, why does the Mary season? Rose sound familiar? Is there a song about it? It's a very old boat, I wouldn't be surprised. Um, but there also would be a lot of uh, ships called Mary Rose. I wouldn't be, because it's like pretty common. I know what I'm thinking of. The ship itself, um, it was a flagship of King Henry VIII, the one who was famous for having like six wives and inventing the concept of divorce. Um, <laughs> He really understood his... the, the point of fuck, Mary kill. He really did. He really, really did. Um, but yeah, the Mary Rose was his flagship. And so there are quite a few songs about it. It's a good old Tudor wreck. It's a very pretty boat. I love it a lot. Is there anything I can do here? Wed bed behead. Do I have anything to sell? Mary Celeste? Yes, I love the Mary Celeste. I've not seen to be see the Mary Celeste, but um, it's a very pretty ship, and I want to go see it. Why are my lights on? They don't need to be on right now. I know it's like not one of those ones that you can actually go see, but there are replicas and stuff, and I, I, wanna, I wanna see those. Oh! Trophy! Okay, that explains what that is. Cool. But yeah, 
my favorite is the Mary Celeste. Oh, my favorite boat I've been on. Was this little row ship from my old ski scout group. It was very fun. This pretty little thing. No, I'm, I'm definitely, it's definitely, at least a ship named the Mary Rose that I'm thinking of. Um, I'll, I'll go sell my fish and I'll look it up real quick. Now I want to go back to Portsmouth. I want to see the Mary Rose again. Not to be a nerd, but I have a fridge magnet of the Mary Rose. <laughs> nerd. I don't have any fridge. It's very magnets. pretty. It's um one of the old artworks of it. I should get a fridge magnet. Should. I figure I can do some night fishing. Stay close to the shore. Lumpy mackerel. <gasps> Lumpy. I do that. That's gonna mess up squid. It looks like a know. normal squid. Well, this is but still going though. But I want it to be a messed though. up squid. Messed up squid. Messed up squid. Yeah. Well, that's a messed up squid. Okay. Where's more? Trying to stick relatively close to. Well, that's something. I can grab that and then go to the other side for the night. There's your squid. Oh, that's a fucked up squid. Oh, so well fresh? Right. Uh, hmm. He... Yeah, no, you're, you're right. Let's go. I love the ocean. I love the mysterious ice that stare at me in the night. Cool. I love it. Guys, my cat is here. She would like me to know. I wish cats were real. I wish squids were real, it's such a good whatever it is. <laughs> yeah, sure. Do you not know the reference? No, I do. It was just a very funny way to put it. I just- I wasn't sure how to describe it. Oh dear. Oh my, you look exhausted. You're not forgetting to get some sleep, are you? As I always say, taking frequent breaks is an important part of being productive. Is that why you don't let the fishmonger sleep? Ah. Everyone's just saying stop being tired. Every single person you've gone to see has said something about you being tired. Yeah, because our sanity is god-awful right now. Oh yeah, um can someone find find me the meme to send no sent? Um oh and I was gonna look a thing up real quick. Yeah, the Mary Rose. Mary Rose even. Okay, yes. 
Out like a lion by white horse starts. I'm not yours, you are mine. Let that sink in like the Mary Rose. Uh, but yeah, if, if someone sends me the reference, I will... What am I doing? Cool, I'm good now, I think. Okay, n n now am I going to the st Stellar Basin or whatever it was? Uh, if you've got the nets, then yeah. I do have the nets. I will check the pot. I think I installed the net. It's giving me... Check which rods I have. I have the flexible fishing pole. Should be fine? Okay. And I can just head directly towards the Stellar Basin, or...? Ding! Ding! What do I have? Did... I think you have something oh, net. on the net. Oh, did, leave it in the net? Okay. Alright. Map, map, map. Okay, I'm just gonna head broadly in the direction of Stellar Basin for now. Okay, good. I was worried about my cat because she was lying on the ground right behind my chair and I was worried I was gonna forget and roll into her, but she's leaving now. Good kitty. E2 has one of the traveling merchant's pontoons. Ooh, okay. Uh, E2. E2. Okay, so we just go, like, around. So D5 and then around. Love to catch fish. Love to be out in the middle of the ocean. Don't touch me. Don't touch me. I see a lighthouse. Touch him. Okay. Touch him. No. I hear the whispering. I'm heading towards the lighthouse. Aurora jellyfish. Possibly head for G4. Friends. That might be smarter. Do not sell the Aurora jellyfish. I see a red thing. Should I be worried? I don't know. Firefly squid. Oh shit, is it coming after me? Okay. 
We're good, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. Welcome to one of the prettiest parts of the day. Okay, I assume we're going like right here. Don't run into the red things. Yeah, I got that. Where is the... An old generator sputters and ticks over. The board. The laboratory is in ruins with equipment and research papers strewn about the place. Where do you want to look? Do I do I care about this yet? Do I do I look in here? Check the cupboards. Empty the cupboards. Equipment on the table. Prototype parts on the other side of the table. You find a hastily scrawled note. It reads, not safe. Expect retaliation imminently returning to fort. Okay, I will... I didn't see a scientist. Okay. There's not one there, this is when I go to D5? Okay. I'm heading around. Red Snapper. Yeah, the, the movement controls and the camera controls are hooked in some way that's uncomfortable to interact with. Like, it's fine, and I'm learning how to deal with it, but I don't like it. The circle in the middle is what I want to avoid. Oh, I can go around the internal outskirts. Whatever, I'm already going this way. I'm catching so many fish. Surely I don't have room for that many fish. Ooh, is that a message in a bottle? I think I might be comfortable enough. I have quite a lot of room in the net. I think I might be comfortable enough to get an engine upgrade next time I have a chance. Nice. We are here to get more fish, not more fish. Anyone here listen to the silt verses? The what? The silt verses. It's a horror podcast. No. Okay. Fucking hello? wasn't expecting visitors. Who are you? Ah, uh, yes, I thought you had to look, but a fisherman all the way out here? S strange. Well, it's a pleasure to meet you all the same. I've not seen another soul in months, so in fact I could do with your help if you had the time. Do you need help with? I need help collecting samples to study. I was originally posted at the research outpost on the interior of the ba basin, but it was attacked. A large creature emerged from the depths and destroyed the outpost. Now it rests in the center of the basin. I fled here and have been making do the best I can, but I had to leave most of my equipment behind, so now my research has come to a halt. Take a look at the list of specimens I need. Please drop them off here. You might need to experiment with different fishing, fishing strategies to collect all of them. That's the fucked up jellyfish. That is the fucked up jellyfish.
Okay, and the wrong squid? Is it? It matches. I didn't. No, I think that was the other one that was the wrong squid. This one matches, yeah. Okay, yeah. and I need to get the glowing octopus. Octopus is night fishing or crab pots. Is there anything else? Hi, Coco. Hi, kitty. Oh my god, I haven't streamed on my own channel in forever. Guys, I have two cats now. <laughs> Friends. Hi, you're in my way. So I have I have Malgorjata and Viswava. Um Margarita and vodka. <laughs> I mean her name actually is Margarita because she's named after a book. And vodka. Uh she's named after the book. Uh, it's a Russian book, which the English translation of the title is The Master and Margarita, and the Polish title is Mishima Malgorzata. And I'm butchering that because I'm in English brain right now. Okay, we're going south. Cook, I can't see. Meow, please don't step on my keyboard. <laughs> Hi, I love you. There's a kitty on the boat, wants fishies. Mm -hmm. I mean, ship's cats are supposed to be lucky. I can't- go to. I cannot they see are. the screen. He, Good kitty. Simon, if you can find the post again, I'd love to see it. What was I doing? Can we repair here? Or no, you want me to go to the thing and re. Okay. Yeah, isn't there a thing I'm down below? I'm smart. Like, me too or something? I'm going south. Yes. For the winter? I don't know if it's winter. I can't tell what season it is. It's not snowing. I think objectively it's kind of funny that I didn't upgrade the engine. Interesting. Jellyfish will be inside the basin. I'm going to the pontoon, don't worry. At least I think I'm going to the pontoon. My navigation skills are iffy. I've gotten lost walking in a straight line. That tracks for you. Everyone is so mean to me all the time! It's true though. the sound of rain hits the roof of my cabin. Is there anything better? Uh, I can sell 
everything, right? Because I already dropped off the things I have. I uh, don't remember. Yeah. Nope. Shipyard. Mm. I would like to repair all. not going to make it. Okay. D d listen, I make bad decisions sometimes. Big long nap. Be night, be night, be night. Go back into the basin, son. Is this not? Am I going? I'm going the wrong way. Got it. I'm struggling. Blowing octopus. Okay, and I assume I should go back to the pontoon and rest till morning, and then go scientist word. Nice. Meow. Hello, kitty. I love torties. I'm gonna have to post some pictures of my cats. Yes, you are. I didn't see Viesha. I didn't see Viesha until later because. She likes to sit up really high, or at least she did when we were, when she was at the shelter and, and I was coming over to look at cats. Um, so I didn't see her at first, uh, but I walked into the shelter and I saw Gosha and I immediately went, that's the prettiest cat I've ever seen in my life. I sent pictures to the Haven Discord, and Sleep said that she looks like if a cowboy was turned into a cat, and I still don't know what that means. No, see, I think that if he said that about Viesha, that she looked faded and slightly dust-covered, because Viesha kind of does, but... Gosha is mostly black. I'm so glad this game doesn't make me worry about fuel. Dark shout out to uh, Sunless Sea. Blood Snapper. Cool.
The fuel mechanic in Sunless Sea is ruthless. It has no ruth. Fuel mechanics in general are kind of ruthless. That's true. Please, thank you. Thank you. Uh, looks like you've caught all the surface specimens I need. But uh, yes, I do need some from uh, deeper down. But that's going to be a problem. Why is that a problem? I developed a device to retrieve samples from the abyssal zone. This was over in the other research outpost before the attack. I have an idea of how to keep the creature at bay long enough to collect these samples, but while I work on that, I need you to retrieve some prototype part. Carefully. I suggest you go during the day. I wouldn't want to be out on the reef at night. Is there anything else? Yeah, I could see sleeping being a good idea. Yeah. Blood snapper. Oh, me, 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 me. Meep. <laughs> no, since it says, man, the orfish is messing with my perception of your hold and what upgrades you have. I'm going <laughs> the wrong way. That's more like it. Yeah, no, I don't care about the rest of this game. I'll care about that next stream. Right now, all I care about is the Orphish. I think a life-sized Orphish banner would be very cool. It would! Or fish are like it 25 would. feet long, aren't they? Something like that. They do also come in smaller. Okay, okay. I I yeah, think but if you're going to get an all fish banner, you want to get the big one. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, I think regularly about the post that's like, the Orphish is the world's longest normal girl. <laughs> True. Yeah, I will dredge. Hi, Kurtko. Broken spectacles. Please let me dock. Eat something. My cat would like me to know. around on the floor. There are cracks in the base of the structure that grow to large gashes as you follow them along the, to the walls. Something extremely large and powerful created these holes. You slowly reach your arm into one. Why? That, that's how you lose your arm. For fun and profit. You pluck an item from a gouge in the floor. I think I can make it back. No, yeah. Let me aim. I 
as we get closer to or fishability, uh, I, I, I get more hype. <laughs> I'm so excited. And we're honestly on track for what I expected, given that I'm streaming this and we're doing, like, voices and stuff. Mm. Listen, I was really glad that w when I asked who wanted to stream with me, you were the one who said yes. Uh, because you specifically are good for long streams. Mmm, wonder why. I, I simply enjoy. Wonder why what? I wonder why you were happy that... I wonder why and how you knew I was going to be good with a good long stream. Yeah, and I don't even anticipate this one being that long. Like, I'm pretty sure we'll still clock in at under four hours. Have you hydrated at all? There's been like five, six now. Hydrated oh shit, no, I forgot. Uh... Entertain oh, chat. Let me assemble a device for you. I'll tab, I'll tab. I'll tab, I'll tab. Entertain chat, I'll be right back. Uh, hello chat. What the fuck was that? <laughs> I can hear my own echo in Moth's mic and it's annoying me. Like, I know that I have stream not muted. So in, I know it's moth mic and I'm I'm grumpy about it. I don't like my voice. I don't like hearing my voice on echo. Uh, stares blankly back. Um, knock knock. Uh Juno. Juno who? Do you know anything other than bad jokes? Ayy. I'm so good at this. I'm so I'm amazing. I'm excellent. Ayy. I return. Why? I was doing a better job than you. Everyone's so mean to me all the time. <laughs> You should have heard my joke, it was the funniest thing ever, and now you're never gonna hear it. Or I can go to 331 or so in the VOD. Yeah, but you're not gonna. Someone text me 331 right now. No. <laughs> absolutely not. Moth I'll doesn't write it get down. to know it. I'll write it down. Not who's there? <laughs> Juno who? I'm waiting. Whatever. I think they're typing. This should allow you to catch specimens from a much greater depth. It's a little slow, but you may be able to make some improvements. Why would you say that? You ruined it. <laughs> Okay, I would like to install this. Where do you even install it? Just a bit so. Mm. I guess I just put it on my boat for now. It won't let me! Yeah, I think you have to put it in your rod spot. Root of it. Can you put it in your storage? Uh, to storage. Now, I've developed a repulsion machine that produces a bright light and emits a high-pitched noise. It should deter the creature from attacking. Or enrage it, I'm not sure. Hmm. Connect to the research outpost generator. 
You'll have to return and re-engage it every few hours, but other than that, it's completely automated. Great. Now, take a look at the list of specimens. Remember, you'll want to install and activate the machine before attempting to collect these. You might also need to approve that equipment I gave you to catch some of these. Hey, one of those guys attacked you earlier. Is there anything else? No, I'm gonna go... Oh, research. Bonk, me, 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 me. Ooh. Is this the th I'm I should probably research this. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna sleep for now, I think. Okay. Storage, storage. You don't need the captain's ring. Fine. <laughs> okay. Okay. Head to Gale Cliff. The smallest vertebrate fish is a paedio pa Oh god, it's paedioctopus? Paedioctopus? Oh god, I can't remember. I have to go hang on, I have to Google it now. I want to go to O3. Oh Paedoctopus. Or Paedocypress. I can't tell. I do okay. not know how to pronounce this. Goshu. Goshu, please. There is not an IPA on the Wikipedia. This is. this is. heartbreaking. Hey, I love you. Through the waterfall? Through the waterfall. Yeah. No, since I'm so glad you're here, have I mentioned that? I'm not. Cat. I am not glad you're here. Yeah, Cap, do you want an oarfish or not? You're an oarfish. You already have one. It's in your heart. Aww. You're only playing for digital whatever the word is. It's no better than an NFT. You're getting an NFT oarfish. How do you feel? Me? Yes. <laughs> mm, I was hoping I could pick something up from that. <laughs> non fungible orphan. <laughs> how deep is your love? Uh, existential terror. How deep do orphishes live at? Live at. Uh, one thousand meters, but can be found up to two hundred meters. Okay. That is 3,280 feet to a height of 656 feet. That's sparkly. You're sparkly. A collection of cases have washed up against the shore. Some have already split open and lost their contents to the waves. Ooh, mine now. <gasps> Didn't the traveling merchant want that? Mm-hmm. Okay, I'm gonna aim for Ingfell. 
for now. You try that. I believe I believe in you, I think. Wow. Hi. I think she wants me to pay attention to her. Could I'll pay attention to her. Could you I love you. I love you. Kitty. You will get my full attention when I'm done with the the orfish. Kitty. I love you. Kitty, I love you. Existential terror says orcas. So close syllabically and yet so far. Uh, no, I want Mind to the, go around it this way. Yeah, there's folk in front of you. about right. Oh, cats. Oh, that's adorable. I'm thinking about that now. I love them. I've definitely seen art of that. I love them. No sense says neither orcas nor cats need any help with, with being better hunters. I mean, they do in... Like, cats need better help on water, and orcas definitely need better help on land, so I think combining them is how humanity finally gets kicked off the top spot. Ooh. <laughs> yes, yes. Yes. I'm so good at this game. I'm just gonna go right past you, right around you. I'm having a normal time. There's normal fish. Ah. Do you need help with anything? stream is okay it's caught up okay i've been trying to prepare a special meal for my partner but i'm a bit having some issues around here we consider aged conga eels to be a particular delicacy you may say they're rotting but they're delicious if prepared correctly normally we bury them in the ground and allow them, and allow them to mature but our dog keeps digging them up and then eating them good for him I can't raise a subject without spoiling the surprise. Can you bring me some aged conga eel? Thank you. You'll be decently compensated. Anything else? Ah yes, they can be tricky to find. I'm told they inhabit the holes and burrows within the cliffs themselves. I imagine they've been fished out around the edges so you may have to venture into the passageways of the cliffs to find them. Oh, did I mention that they only come out at night? Yes, I believe they hide during the day. Good luck. Anything else? Nope. Okay, storage. I will deposit that. I feel like that retired whaler is the hermit's brother he was talking about. Probably. Okay, I'm going around the back. I'm 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 gonna go around the back. There is a number next to my net. It's how many fish is in there, I think. 
yeah. Feasty. So would there be enough room for the oarfish in there? The gutter. You can check. I will literally throw things out if I need to. We are here for one thing and one thing only. Existential Terror says you can jettison the motor to save space. This is true. <gasps> oh god! Uh- Friend? Friend. Should I be worried about that? You warned me? I don't remember being warned, but... Okay. Okay, you said something like O3? My ship is on fire. In here? Am I doing it wrong? Oh, the waterfall. Well, I see a waterfall. I also see that looks like a message in a bottle. I think it is, yeah. Oh, it's the other thing. Family crest! Yo, that's a thing! Fish, fish, fish. This is the guy! Thingy. I'm gonna bite you. I'm so nervous. Stop being nervous and hit the green thingy. He's so long. Uh, I can turn him. That's our oarfish! Secret oarfish cave! That's the oarfish! <laughs> he's beautiful! Look at him! Oh, he's a Sorry, is the, is the- hang on, is the oarfish on the stream covering this? No, he's not. No, okay. He's next to him. They're, they're next to each other. They're friends! Beautiful. Okay. I 
I'm going to get to wherever the closest dock is. I think it's back around by Ingfo. Well, the go dusty around, one. Go around to the pontoon. Yeah, we can we can come yeah, back pontoon. here. We can. Something slithers into my cargo hold. There's a dock just behind me. Uh, that was. I don't think this is a dock. What about my oarfish? <gasps> it was. My oarfish. Oh. Oh, outside the cave. One? No, there's only one oarfish in the game. Oh. No one says it's fine. Poor oarfish. Oh, I'm sad. That, this, the ship? If you go through the hole just to the right. Just get out of where I am right now, okay. E or fish. Oh, are they counting this as a dock? Looks like it. Is she campsite? Okay. And now the game is saved. Uh, should be. I'm gonna undock and redock just to like extra make sure. Okay. Or fifty percent. We got the boy. And then he got fucked up real bad. He got fucked up real bad! We got our boy! Orfish percent! Yeah. How long was that? Um... 3 hours 51 minutes? I mean, not well, all of that was in the game, record. but that's the how long the stream is going. I mean, that's technically a world record. Nobody's done this before. <laughs> yeah! Alright, let's wrap this up. Oi! Yippee, yippee, yippee! Alright. Save and quit. There's nothing wrong with our orfish, he's beautiful. Okay, OBS. Let me go to end screen, which also has an orfish. It, it does. Important, important. Look at him. Alright, let me see if anyone's live. Okay, mischief, but that's the yeah. Orfish. Happy World Orfish Day, everyone! This was lovely. Thank you. Happy Thank World you. Orfish Day. Thank you so much, Existential Terror, for being here. All right. Oh, it looks like Beanie's live. Yippee! Yippee! Everyone, go say hi to Beanie. We love Beanie. And tell them Happy Orfish Day. Raid. Raid. Yes, there. Okay. Yay! Happy Orfish Day! Happy still Orfish go with Day! Beanie happy Orfish Day! I think we should all wish Beanie Happy Orfish Day. We should all wish Beanie Happy Orfish Day. Alright! Farewell, everyone! Happy Orfish Day! Beanie.